Hello everyone. In this video we're going to show you how to manually close a roof on an Audi A3 8V Cabriolet. So to start off, what we need to do is open all the windows. So with the ignition in the on position, sometimes you can press a button on the steering wheel to stop the bleeping. You press the window down button and ensure all four windows are open. We will then remove the key and leave that on the dashboard and hold the roof close button down for five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. And now we have to open the tailgate. So we'll press the unlock button and proceed to opening the tailgate such that we can drop the rear seats forward. We open the tailgate and pull the catch either side. Let's just also remove the wheel brace, which we will need later on. Put this away and close the tailgate. Now we have the rear seats forward, we have to open the storage compartment lid. Unfortunately, somebody has broken the little release hook for opening the storage compartment lid, which would be over here. So the next step we will have to do electronically, but what you would do is according to the manual, there's a little red hook here, you grab it with your finger and you pull it down. With the storage compartment lid unlocked, you should now be able to open it. So to get your hand in, you can push this flap forward, get your hand under the lid, but make sure you're holding it on the metal and not on the plastic. So get your hand inside and open the storage compartment lid. This will have some hydraulic pressure in there, so it takes its time. And bring that all the way up, and when in position, you should be able to just lock this like that and you come around the other side and do the same thing. So just push your hand towards the rear of the vehicle and lock that to stop that closing on you. But before we lift the roof out the storage compartment, we need to open the forks. This one here and that one there. So we'll start off by removing this cap. We're going to use a pick because we don't want to damage any of the trim. Just get that in the corner and lift it out. This reveals a bolt where we will use the wheel brace to open the forks. Locate it onto the central bolt and turn this in a clockwise direction. And you will see as you turn it, the forks start to open. Keep going until the forks stop opening and you'll feel a stop. We're now ready to take the roof out of the storage compartment. We will start by taking our shoes off and standing on the rear seats. Make sure you hold the roof on either side and pull it up parallel. Once you have it in this position, you then come round to the back while holding the front up, you lift the back up, like this. You then hold this and you start by closing the storage compartment lid. Now obviously it's locked, so we have to come around here, hold it up and then pull this towards the front of the vehicle and the storage compartment lid will begin to close. With that closed, you then release the rear bow. Now we are going to proceed to the front of the vehicle in order to lock the roof to the windscreen frame. Just pull that down and make sure it's come close. Okay, now that's close, we can then use the wheel brace to lock this onto the frame. To lock it onto the frame, position the wheel brace this position and then turn it anti-clockwise and you will find the roof will lock onto the frame. Unfortunately there's no way to lock the rear deck lid down 
as the vehicle now needs to come for repair. To finish off, let's put this cap back where it belongs. So these two tangs go to the front of the vehicle. Put that in position and clip that back in. We hope you found our video useful. Please subscribe, like and hit share on our YouTube channel.